good evening wherever you are in the world. Um, if you remember uh, from my um, last week's video, we was on a um, on a field, uh, and I was going to do it between the iron really slowly on a high di uh, recovery, and we came up with that the, um, little silver club, um, and that was interesting. I said. You know, I ran out of time, I'm going to come back to that field, and that's what I've done today. So I'm just on my way down there now, um, and I will see you lot on the first hole. So I've just uh, dug this hole out down here, and uh, I've got my first bag seal of the day. Look at that, it's got uh, some writing on it. How about that? Uh, it only came up a very low number. Uh, seven, nine. It's like it's got some writing on there. Sussex. I must say Sussex at the bottom. S U S S, and then it fades out a bit. Right. That's a good start. Right. First bag seal. On to the next. I've been going twenty minutes, uh, but I've uh, managed to find an eighteen. You can see that? Shall we, shall we dig it up? See what it could be? Got it out. It's in the scrub somewhere. Oh. 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 We've got silver. Oh, is that silver? Is it silver? We might. Okay, shall we do this together? What could it be? Oh. Is it silver, would you say? It, yeah, there's a bit of tarnish on it. This could be a... Oh, it could be another love token. I don't know if we're going to get anything on, off this. Okay. Right. Let's just take the gloves off. Oh. I can feel the, the weight of it then. It's definitely silver. Alright, we've got silver, but it's probably going to be nothing on it. Another, I would say a love token, but love tokens are usually bent into an S. And people that don't know much about love tokens and why they're called love tokens uh, what it is is that if uh, if a chap in the field uh, saw someone he liked he will get a love token, bend it into an S and uh, he will give it to the girl and if she was interested uh, she would keep it and if she wasn't interested she'd throw it over her shoulder and then it would be lost from someone like me to find uh, it's silver but unfortunately we've got nothing on it a little bit of silver oh, it's, a, it's such a shame that it's just very worn alright first bit of silver right on to the next I've got a a target here and I want to see if my fear is right on a live dig I can you can see the iron but you see the iron around it you might not be able to hear it what I'll do is I'll see if I can take the speaker out see if you can heal that iron but I'm still getting a little target amongst it all. Now I'll see if that has been disguised by the iron and there is a target there. Right, let's see if I can pinpoint it. Right, it's just there. So let's see if we can do a live dig. Actually, I think this has been dug out before. This is...
Ignore that side. The numbers are getting quite high now. This might be a bit difficult to get to. So let's just... Right, I'll get back to you on this. Once you get it out, a much clearer signal now. There was iron disguising it. Oh, look at that. We've got a coin. Our first coin. Yep. See, it just goes to show that there's things being disguised by iron. Right. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to see anything on it. There's a penny, but uh, I think the head is that side. Well, I'll just give it a slightly rub. Let's uh, so see who that could be. Right, there's a head coming. Oh, it might be a Vicky. Okay. Right, we'll have to give that a clean up later. And uh, I want to get a head on it, so I'll be able to put a picture up on, uh, on here. And so you can see the date and uh, who reigned in that time, but I've got a feeling that could be a Vicky. Right, on to the next best coin of the day. A good signal here. Uh, I've got a feeling that sounds, listen to that, 2526. That sounds like a coin to me. What do you think? Do you think it's a coin? I think it's going to be a coin. Uh, I just hope I'm not wrong. Pump. Oh, is it at the pump? No, it's at the pump. Oh, is it a coin? Oh, it's the wrong size for a coin. Oh, it's a bullet. That's a bullet. That rang up really nice as well. Right, on to the next. 13 in here. That was just there. So we'll see if we can do this or not. Got it out. Okay. It's in. Oh. 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 What have we got here? Okay. Yes. Oh. There might be a button. It could be a button. Uh, yep, yeah, I can feel a shank on it. Okay. Uh, yep. Yeah. We've got a button. Right. On to the next. Oh, is a... Ten. Ten. Eleven. Right, let's see what this could be. Okay, where is it then? 
Oh, that's working. Is that falling, I think? Staying in that clump for some reason. I'm not finding it. Ah, right, here we go. Oh, now is that a button? Was it a coin? Oh, it's a button. Is it a button? It's part of a key lock, I think. It's a part of a, that goes on, yeah, it's part of a key lock. Uh, that's what it looks to me. The little key goes in there. Right, on to the next. Got a, there was a 17 down here. It's quite deep. I think just about there. Uh, let's have a look. Let's see if we can uh, find anything interesting. Oh, oh, I think I see something. Is that it? Oh, it's a part of a spoon. We've got a handle of a spoon. Got, have you got anything on it? Oh! Oh! It's got a... Markings on it. Oh, we got might have a silver spoon here. Is it a silver spoon? Oh. Okay, let's just see if I can... Give it a bit of a... Look where the markings might be. Yep, oh yeah, there is markings on it, there is a hallmark on it, so, but I wouldn't have thought that would be silver, it might have been silver plated, but hey ho, that's not bad, alright, silver plated spoon, okay on to the next, we've got a fake cell, but now we've got a Solid 16. Shall we see what it is? What's that? What's that? What's that? Is it a, a nothing? Is it a summit? Oh, it's it's heavy. Oh, oh, hold on. What have we got here? I think this is it's lead. So, uh, I've got a feeling, does that look like a figure? Well, okay, hold on, I'm just going to put you back in my, my compartment, and so I can get both hands to clean it up, and have a little look. Okay. Oh, it's definitely something. Oh, yeah. But, I don't know, it looks like it's got a monkey's face. That's the head. Oh, this is something. This is interesting. Okay. Very. That is one ugly person. <laughs> it does, it looks like it's a some sort of monkey or a big round head but, yeah you can see the arms two legs oh that is unusual I like that something led now being led it's quite hard it's going to be hard quite to date so this is uh, one for the old man to see if he give me some idea It's got a dress. Alright, okay, I'll get back to you. Hi. 
Yeah, it's in that there. I think. Yeah. Whatever it is, it's uh, it's very small. I can feel it. Uh, if I can give it a bit of a rub. Oh, yeah. uh. Silver disket. Oh, is that silver? You see that tarnish? Okay, chaps, uh, I'll get back to you. Just got to try and clean this up and see what it could be. Right, in two secs. A little bit of a clean up, and look. I thought it might have been like a little brooch, but it's the the pin at the back of it, it's more like a, they would fasten onto their clothes, so it's it's more likely to be Georgian. Georgian little silver brooch. There you go, double silver today. How about that? Well will chuffle myself. I'll give that a nice clean, that'll come up really nice. And the old man, he's, uh, he's got a, uh, oh he's got an old, old uh, button. War button, navy button, is that navy? Well it's got oh, a crown on it. It's got it. a crown on it. Don't know what it says. No, gold. As yet, you can see it's gilt. gilt, but you can see it's a button. Awesome. Oh, we're having a good day today. Brilliant. Well, right, I'll see you on the next hole. Well, I just dug this out, this is eight. And I thought it was going to be a gunshot cartridge, but <laughs> it's a thimble, a very squashed thimble, just a copper one, it's quite a big one as well, so, yep, you can see the, uh, the little dents, now usually, you can usually tell if it's precise, it's machine made, not precise with the pimples it's handmade uh, by looks of it this one's a uh, machine sh machine made I don't want to rub it too much because the top of it's all coming off there you go first thimble of the day unusable though right on to the next it's very faint we must spade out the way but I've got a 30 I'm in the 30s very faint, very quite faint, so it's quite deep. So I'll get back to you when I dug it up. You know, I might have a coin here. It was, uh, it was very deep. Look at, Look at that. Over my, that's a shovel. That's got to be an E. Twelve inches. Twelve inches down. Oh, oh, I can see a head. This is a, this is a, apart from the. Uh, the love token. This is actually the first coin of the day. I think we might be able to get some detail of that. Lightly. I haven't got my toothbrush with me today. <sighs> Keep getting the paint in my rucksack. So, uh, let me just have a look in the sun a bit. See if I can see anything. Right, okay, I'll get home, I'll clean it up, I've got a feeling I might just be able to get ahead of that. Uh, and I'll let you know. Right, on to the next. I'm going to swing for a little bit, find one more hole, and I'm going to call it a day. So I thought, why don't we swing together, and, uh, and whatever it be, will be. If it's junk, it's junk. If it's good, then hooray. <laughs> I'm happy already today. I've had uh, double silver. Uh, nice little uh, lead figure. So, uh, well chuffed. Uh, and me and my old man were just took saying, I've hit this field so many times and we're still getting stuff. 
signal's a bit far far between now especially um because I'm, I'm out of that field now so i'm walk, walking back to uh, the lane might not even get another signal before i get to the lane we have one signal one little signal um, so i've got on a fast recovery still oh dug there before. Not so much. Iron underneath. Right, I've had a, uh, I did have a hammy out of this little patch here. Uh, let's go by this. Oh! No, iron. I have hammered this little area. Quite solid. When you find a hammer core, you seem to go in a circle round it and really go slowly and dig up more or less anything that's got a slight signal, just in case there's more hammer coins in that area. Number. Shall we dig it? Shall we dig it? Oh, I'll leave that one. I'll come come back for that one another time. Yeah, it's not very uh, good sound. Slightly better one. Right. Oh, almost there. All right. Let's just go in a circle somewhere. Anyway, tomorrow I'm back out again. So, uh, oh, what's that? Ah, that's very irony there. Yeah, tomorrow I'm back out again on a new farm. Well, I've been on it once, but we only there's so many fields. There's, we've got to go on a new field over there, so that we've not been on. Um, the farmer has said uh, she has lost her, uh, her ring, her wedding ring. Uh, so if we hit that field where she might have lost it, we might find it and be able to give it back to her. I like doing things like that. If I try and find it's sentimental, these things like that are sentimental. Right. Okay. I'm going to have to call that a day. Just approaching the the gate. Oh, maybe I should have dug that ten. <sighs> a bit of a scratchy number anyway. Not very much that I'll get anything now. All right. So uh, anyway, I'm gonna stop now. Very hard to stop, <laughs> as you met a detectors. Oh no, so addictive. Right, but yes, got to stop. And I will see you, if you watch my video tomorrow, I will see you all tomorrow. Toodaloo.